Hello there my friend. Welcome to the channel and thank you for watching. In this video, we are going to discuss about the king himself, the king of Egypt, Mo Salah. This guy is a very good player. Everybody knows about it. In the last game against Man City, he just proved to the world that he's right on top there eating in the same table as Leo Messi, Cristiano Ronaldo, Mbappe, Haaland. I don't care what other people are gonna say, but I see him right there. Or maybe a little bit below them because he doesn't have a big name. You know, if he had a huge name and from Brazil or Argentina or Portugal or France, people were going to pay more attention to this guy. Listen, Mo Salah came to my club first when he joined England came to Chelsea but for some reason we didn't use him for one reason or another one and I, uh, I heard all kind of critics about this guy here I'm not gonna get to that anymore because people online think that they know better one or few games you are a flop you need to go you know one season one poor season just equal you are a poor player i'm not gonna get into that when he came to chelsea he was very young okay fighting with eden hazard and you know other players in his position so you can understand why chelsea let him go on loan the thing that i didn't understand is just to sell him permanently for some reason but it is what it is back then uh, the social media wasn't the same as today otherwise he was going to be murdered and also when he joined Liverpool people said oh this is a Chelsea reject he's not good enough blah 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 look what is happening people grow with the time people improve I hope that certain people can learn something from this you don't have to always be uh, buy big names you can you can buy low profile names and make them big stars as long as you create a system around them that will allow them to improve and progress you know what I'm trying to say the question now that I see online is who is better between uh, Mo Salah and Eden Hazard you know it's always like this because we need topics now nah? <laughs> and that is going to make a lot of uh, noise so you take it as you like but Mo Salah is on his prime at the moment like I said and uh, Eden as Hazard is like 31 years old injury prone but on their prime it's very difficult to really judge them I am just going to appreciate them and now I heard about his new contract at Liverpool and apparently he asked for 500k a week or something like that. I know those are just paper talk, the media, you know, try to create something for clicks and all that. I don't believe that he is demanding 500k, but the question is, do you think that he deserved that kind of money? <laughs> you know what I mean? like the same salary as Messi and Ronaldo depend on how you see it but I think Liverpool are going to be crazy if they don't give a big huge I mean big contract to keep this guy because he's that guy he's that good and PSG can offer more than 400k a week so it's gonna be very interesting to see where he's going to end up next summer because if he doesn't sign as soon as possible believe me real are going to be there psg are going to be there probably barcelona but you know with the financial issues that they are having i don't know what's gonna happen but i see mo salah probably go to psg get a lot of money win a lot of trophies this is his last contract so i'm not gonna blame him for demanding a lot of money but 500k a week is kind of a little bit too much but if the club decide to give him that money why not okay so in this current moment really if you have to compare more Salah with the rest 
Messi, Neymar. I don't even put Neymar in the same discussion because that guy is getting overweight. He can't dribble anymore. Messi, we you know, huh? He's you know 34 years old. He's not running anymore. You know, walking on the field all the time. But Mo Salah is like pretty much would do everything. So at the moment, really, the discussion need to be to be really serious here with no disrespect to Messi but I think Mo Salah can knock the door right on top there leave your comment and let's have a conversation subscribe to the channel give this video a like and I will see you next time